Our uh, evaluation was a review of all the published scientific literature on glyphosate mm -hmm. and this was done by the world's best experts on the topic that in addition don't have any conflicts of interest that mm -hmm. could bias their assessment and they concluded yes glyphosate is probably carcinogenic to humans based on three strings of evidence that is clear evidence for cancer in experimental animals mm -hmm limited evidence for cancer in humans from real-world exposures of exposed farmers and also uh, strong evidence that it can damage the genes from any kind of other toxicological studies. Why is not glyphosate banned considering these findings which are damning? This is really an independent review of all the published literature that then leads to a classification of what we know about the substance and particularly its cancer-causing effects. Mm -hmm. But then it's to other agencies, WHO internationally or other national agencies, to turn that into a risk assessment and decide on the different exposure scenarios as a farmer from the diet, in cosmetics, wherever the substance can end up, mm -hmm. to come up with conclusions. Last May, uh, a joint food and agriculture organization, FAO, WHO panel, gave glyphosate a clean bill of health. Why this change of heart? Our classification of the cancer hazards of glyphosate still stand. We are the authority to classify uh, cancer uh, substances worldwide for WHO. And it was then this other panel that looked at a very a narrow angle of exposure from the daily food mm -hmm. and then came up with the conclusion on how much of that may be safe or not. But as a consumer, as a farmer, as an occasional beer drinker, as somebody who likes to sit in parks that have been treated with glyphosate, um, what and who should I believe? I think it is important to, uh, to understand the literature that our assessment that glyphosate uh, can cause cancer in humans still stands. And then you have to look at the other assessments for the specific scenarios. And that is not my uh, authority to comment on these other evaluations. There are credible reports that emerge after this uh, joint FAO WHO uh, panel uh, back in May that some of the scientists had uh, received payoffs uh, by Monsanto, which is the, the number one producer of glyphosate. I mean, is it, as a scientist, are you disturbed by this kind of reports? It is an important topic that needs uh, important scrutiny, yes. <laughs>